Hello everybody and welcome to my indie game spotlight for Vertiginous Golf, or simply put, Vertigolf. Now this one is said to be a dystopian steampunk golf game that is powered by a mysterious Victorian era virtual reality device. Now that's funny to me because golf games are generally considered to be the most bland of games and how can you really change a golf genre? While well, this game is showing you that you can change anything if you put your mind to it. This is a... Again, it's a steampunk golf game with virtual reality. <laughs> so let's uh, walk up to the shop here and oh, look, look at this. We have now opening to the public. Yada, 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 yada. So there is a storyline to this game and from what I quickly read, Vertiginous Golf is a store as you can see. And it's for the upper class, it's entertainment for the upper class. The lower class out here is not welcome. Basically what they did was build a a golf course in the sky, which is a, of a steampunk stylized golf course, and uh, they connect to it via virtual reality in this shop. And the whole point of that is to keep these uh, lower class scumbags outside of their entertainment. So let's go into their wonderful shop here and see what's so nice about it. Okay, so we, uh, it, looks, it looks like a nice cozy lounge, I'll, I'll give them that. And it definitely does feel steampunkish, so we got a bunch of screens here. And a lot of a lot of games have been doing this as of late, having like different types of uh, UI, and I really enjoy that. Uh, so we got options, local multiplayer has it has four player local multiplayer, but uh, online multiplayer is in development for full release. Um, and it's got 15 courses currently, and uh, let's let's hit play here. I'm not going to stay here too long, and it looks like this seat is opening up for me to join in. All right. And bam, we are there on the course. That is so weird. It's just it, a, a virtual reality golf game is loopy to me. And yes, there's a hummingbird hovering over my golf club. Don't be alarmed. That's just totally normal in this game. Uh, click the drag mouse. So this is the tutorial actually, and I figured, um, where what better of a place to showcase the game than the tutorial? Well, I avoid a lot of tutorials, but in this one, it showcases a lot of the mechanics, a lot of the functions. And I can get it off across very quickly to, to you guys. So uh, as you can see, it is more of a mini putt game than a golf game. So uh, I, I I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of mini putt games. I was hoping it would be an actual golf game, but this th this game does it well. It has, from what I can see, it has very enjoyable courses, and that's important. So press the key, the, the key labeled C. So I guess the C key. I guess that's kind of a Steampunkish way to say steam the yeah, C C key. Okay, so if we go over here. I think we got to aim all the way up and get over there. Perfect, and land on the rug. <laughs> I I never thought I'd say in a golf game land on the rug. Use either club to get over here. I'm going to use the putting club. If you didn't notice, I changed clubs there. So this one is called the chipping club, which is actually just a driving club. It's actually a wood. But, um, and this one is the putter, or, well, it doesn't even look like a putter, but hey, it, it is a putter. So let's, uh, let's, uh, go up this thing. Actually, if you read this, you don't have to lose a stroke. A, press A or Z. So that's, uh, a rewind functionality type thing. It's not, not really rewinding. You just hit this in the air, and then it resets to your spot. I don't really get how that's rewinding. Maybe I'm doing it wrong or something else. Let's try Z here and see what this does. No, that does the same thing. So both... Maybe they're still implementing it, but for, that's not really rewinding. That's just resetting. Um, two totally different words. Uh, okay, so let's go over this and uh, see where we land. All right, perfect. What a shot. Um, notice how your rewind power depletes. Yes, I do see that. Perfect. And then as you take shots, it replenishes. Pressing X will cycle through points of interest cameras. So if you want to get all strategic, there are cameras looking at the whole course. And you actually can see my shots as well. Which is actually really cool. I, I enjoy that. That is really neat. Uh, we can go through a whole bunch of cameras here. I'm not going to spend too much time on this. There's actually 11 cameras on this course. So holy crap. And um, if you're wondering what that hummingbird does, I forgot about that. Um, let's see if I do this right. No, that's that's not the hummingbird. V is the hummingbird. So basically, it's just a, a movable camera where you can... Why, why am I going so high? Oh my god. Oh, I, this, this, this is definitely a glitch. Um... Usually what happens with the hummingbird is it goes around the course, but for some reason I keep flying up. Uh, I'm just going to get out of this, and he's right back down by my club immediately. That is one fast hummingbird. All right, let's shoot it through this hole, and up through the pipe we go. And 
<laughs> down the rugs, the the loads of rugs, and we are at a teleporter now. Sweet. Oh man, that's gonna be a hard shot. Uh, okay, so let's hit it in there. Nope, that's definitely not. I, I gotta hit it way quicker than that. Doop uh, doop. Oh, way way too quick now. Oh my god. All right. So you do have to really be touchy with this game. Because there's only two clubs. Oh, wow, look at that. Uh, you, you don't really have much room for error in this game. Um, obstacles. So that I guess they call this an obstacle. I, 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 I don't know about their wording. I mean, this is not really an obstacle. This is just a... I don't know. I, I, I guess it is an obstacle. Okay, I'm just going to shut up and do this. There are many obstacles and forces in this game. It will affect your balls, my m movement, yada, yada, yada. Let's go across the course. Uh, oh, shoot, am I going too fast? It's gonna go back, and... Oh, man. Okay, we made it. We got lucky. Ooh, look at this. So there's fans. Um, fans levitate, obviously. Let's go over there. Oh, crap, too fast. Way too fast. Oh, I almost I almost bounced back. That, that would've been awesome. So next, a nice slow shot, then. Oh, man, this might be too fast as well. Nope, we're good. And what the hell? Helicopters bring you down. Okay, so we just have to wait for the helicopters to go across. Oh, I think I gotta change clubs, don't I? Oh, why, why is, why, why is my bird going crazy? Oh, yeah, definitely gotta change clubs. Okay, so let's uh, change to the chipper, as they call it, and shoot all the way across. Now I, I don't know how the ha helicopters, how helicopters would have brought me down if I used that, but uh, I'm not going to complain. Oh, there's nice music. That is so nice. Oh, this is nice. Now I guess we go up here, and <laughs> that's cool. I definitely do like these courses. These are great mini putt courses. Um, free stroke hole. If you pot this hole, you won't lose a stroke. Combine these in a course to achieve a hole in one. So this is your way to achieve a hole in one in a very long mini putting course. Basically, if you keep getting holes in ones in these, I guess it considers it not as a stroke. Kind of cool. Um, this is a water hazard. Decrease your power. All right, so let's uh, chip it up there. Oh, look at that shot! That was beautiful. Oh, what the hell is it? Oh, there's another one. Um, oh, ooh, I can't read it. I can't read it. However, the number above the hole indicates how many strokes it takes before the hole closes. X means it's closed. Head into the green room. Okay. Green room is where the flag resides. This is also a place... I guess this is really hard to read. Where you cannot use your pitching club. Okay, so... Oh, I thought, I thought it was called chipping. I guess it's called pitching. Okay. All right, so let's go in here. This is the green room. Oh, spinnies. Oh, oh, oh my god, that would have been awesome if I got it in. And it looks like this is the end of the course, and this camera is really weird. Oh my god, I tapped that. Look at the red on that. I. Oh my god, okay, this is going to be hard. I'm just going to try and get it out of, off these plates. That did not work. Damn, those plates are really strong. Now, now I'm really screwed. All right, I'm going to bounce it off the wall over here. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Stay, 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 stay. Stay. Just don't go near the plate. Perfect. That, that, that's good. And there, there is no aimer in this game, if you haven't noticed. And I actually like that. I, one, one thing I hate about golf games is how much it helps you. I mean, the game's easy enough as it is. It's just golf. Why would you add an aimer? All right, let's do that. Oh, my lord. How? I'm tapping it almost. So I think they need to change this a bit, maybe add a few more clubs. I'm going to bounce it off the wall here. There we go. So that was a, a really quick tap, and as you can see, I'm still going really far. Oh god, I'm so close to the hole. I tapped it. I literally could not hit it any faster. Okay, so this is one issue with the game. Again, it is in early beta, so there is going to be issues. I Yeah, I, I can't hit it any slower than that. I really don't know how they expect me to get in there. So I am going to make a complaint about that. That is ridiculous. I am literally tapping it to get it in that hole. Um, maybe there's something I can do to do it any way, way different, but um, as it currently stands, that is way too hard. It's already complete. Kick the arrow to play in, to play the course. All right. Now, I don't, I, don't, I don't know if these guys are English or not, but they're, I don't know, they're, their signs are kind of confusing for me. Ooh, look at this. All right, so if we hit our bird here, let's go fly around. Um, it, why is it still doing this? Is there... 
Do, do I have my, like, gamepad plugged in or something? Or is he just flying up on his own? Okay, he is flying up on his own. Just making sure. This is a long freaking course. Oh, wait. Are, are these... Okay, so these are all the courses. So, if we quickly just look at them, we can see the different types of things they have. Um, they, they, they all look pretty similar, but obviously having their own... Ooh, look at that one. I want to play that one. That one's got, like, a half pipe going on. Very cool. Uh, I don't think that's 15, but what, whatever. It's, it has to be close. All right, we're going to go back. I guess we'll just shoot this and hope for the best. Okay. Oh, whoa. Okay. Did, did not expect that. Okay, so I have to get it in here. To get... I have one more shot to get it in there, but I have to wait. Oh, there we go. Go, go. Oh my god, I did it. Skills. Skills. So much skills. Okay. Let's go down here. Oh, no? You don't want me to go... Oh, okay. I guess I want to... <laughs> Where the hell do I go? Oh, I shoot it over here? No. Do I? Oh, man, I just wasted a shot. I must shoot it over there. Look at this! Look at this! Oh, my God, that is so cool. Um, I have one more shot with this one. No, I don't. It's close, isn't it? They're both... Cl I, don't, I don't trust it. I, I, I think they're close. Look at this. I, I have to shoot it into that thing. That is really cool. Oh, man. And if it goes too fast, it goes right off. That is really freaking cool. But I think I have an easy shot now. I just go full blast. Yeah, there we go. Oh, my God. It's a little, it's a little football field. Oh, my God. I don't know where to go. This is ridiculous. This is like epic mini putt action. All right. This thing is moving. This, th I, what, what the hell are you? Oh, oh, come on, come on! Oh my God! Now, how, how do I? What's the best way to go? I guess I'll just shoot it over here. Don't go too far. There we go. Perfect. Oh, don't get hit by the rover thing. I don't even know what the, the hell that thing is. Um, so I just gotta tap it, pretty much. <gasps> no, no, stay up there. Okay, okay. I think, I think we got this now. Again, oh god. Okay, so this, if, if I can tap it really quickly here, I got this easy. So, sorry, that was really loud. I had to, I had to tap so quickly. Hole one, par five, shots 11. Yes! Typical to my golf game. So let's go to the next hole. We'll do one more hole, and then we'll end it. Assuming I can even do the hole. Ooh, look, is this the half, this is, this is the half pipe one. Good, this is the one I wanted to do. Um, what the hell do I do here? Looks like I have to get it in that. So we're going to go a bit to the right here because this thing's obviously going to pull my ball to the left. I'm just going to hope for the best. Oh my god! Oh! Oh my god! Skills! 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 Oh, come on! This is really annoying. Oh, now it just closes on me? Oh my god. Okay, so I have to wait for this. Oh god. Okay, so... I, and I can't hold the power either, so I gotta, like, ju- Oh, my god. Oh, whoa. Whoa! <laughs> I don't know what happened there. I accidentally let, let it off. I don't even know if this is the right way. Oh, my god. Oh, so, so I can fall out of that? Oh, Jesus. So I can't shoot it too fast, either. This is gonna take me forever. Oh, my god. I, of course I hit that. Oh, of course it goes this way. I, I guess this would be an easier way just to go across here. Do do a little half pipe action. Woo! Oh my god, that was perfect. That, that, that was like textbook ha half pipe a action right there, or quarter pipe rather. Um, now which way do I go? I guess I just ma make it fall down here. Yeah, look at that. Nice. Then slide over. Oh the, no! This is this is the wrong hole. How, where the hell do I go? Oh, god damn it. There's, there's too many holes in this thing. I guess I got... Yeah, it looks like I gotta go... Ooh, this is gonna be a very hard shot. Oh, slow down. Slow. Stop. Stop. No! I can just... I can restart. Okay. I, I forget how, how hard I hit it. There we go. That should be good. Oh, look at that. Textbook. Now, what is that bullseye for? I I'm not even gonna test it. Let's just go down here. Um... Looks like I need to shoot it over there, I'm assuming. Isn't that the place I was at? Or is this the same kind of spot? 
Oh yeah, what a shot though. Now this one's a bit different. I, I, I guess each one has its own little green. This is essentially the green of the course. Oh yeah, I can't do that. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, come on, come on, come on, ramp. Come on, ramp. Come on. Oh, you're, you're not going to make it? Alright, I'm just going to guess. <laughs> that didn't go too well. Boop. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, stay in. Oh, thank God for that pull. Alright. Alright, so as long as I'm over here, I'm happy. Oh, God. Perfect! Look at that! Textbook shot right there, my friends. Textbook shot. Oh, God damn it. Now I'm way too close. I'm gonna have to bank it off the wall. That's probably the better idea. Come on. Yes! Yes! Alright. Hole 2, par 5. <laughs> Not 16. Score 17. Alright, guys. I'm gonna end this one here. This is uh, Vertigo Golf. Or, uh, sorry. Vertigious Golf. Um, or simply Vertigolf. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be released on Steam as an early access title in March. If you want to pick it up now, you can actually pick it up on their website. All the links will be down below. I think it's uh, 15 bucks. so if you like what you see, go ahead and buy it and support them as they're developing the game. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.